Hello YouTube, welcome to tutorial where we will learn how to change only one thing in a column on that specific row. So objective will be in a telephone column to change John's number to six zeros. It is a stupid number, but it is good for illustration. It is simple to remember what you are doing. Okay, but you need to be extremely cautious here because one error can destroy everything in at least one column and we will intentionally get into error but a little bit later let's just start with the simple stuff here so update and that's the new keyword update in which table friends okay and then you need to say set uppercase but set where set in a specific column which in this case will be telephone now what is the value zero 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 okay press enter once okay only once and let's go to next line now we need to say where we need to change this thing we have actual command update and set something we have our target uh, and our actual value but where is that row so you need to at least use id here or a combination of couple of names of columns so simplest possible way is to use ID if they are different so if they are set as automatic increment right so where ID equals one in this case and the better option will be to enclose that into normal brackets okay it's easier for to understand now semicolon don't forget that and enter and row one request is done so let's see uh, do we have actual results and there you go we have zero why we don't have a six zeros here well because zero is zero no matter how you times type it okay so maybe we can use something else so let's actually change this zero to 999999 and approach will be again update table said that the data in a telephone column is this one where for id that is one okay and now let's list our re result and there you go we have everything what needs to be done now here's the thing to be totally sure that you will not run into error do combine couple of columns to be absolutely sure that you will not destroy everything here so what will the approach be here update again co uh, friends set telephone for example or set actually last name let's say that is equal to gates, gates, okay, couple of z's. Okay, and let's go to next line, where? So, now we will combine things, where a name equals uh, bill and last name equals gates okay one s so you cannot combine ids here because they are different but you can change actual strings okay let's issue that command and result will be uh two things changed so let's list our stuff and there you go we have gate z here as a new value okay so definitely do combine a couple of things to be sure that you will not change everything else so why am i always stating that be cautious because of this and now we will with one line destroy absolutely everything in a one column and can you imagine what kind of impact will be in your company if you create that kind of error for example some prices or sold product or, or, or a worker's salary i mean it is it can cost you immense amount of money so this one line is like evaded like a plague 
update, for example, friends, set, for example, telephone that is uh, 111 111. And now you will not state where. So default is everywhere. And it is extremely dangerous and scary. Check this out. Now you will say, oh, everything is fine. Is it? All eight rows affected. So absolutely everything. If you have 10,000 rows here, they will all be totally destroyed. And check this listing. Select all from friends. There you go everything is totally messed up now i'm using here you know only numbers but you just get the point if you enter something stupid like uh i don't know set telephone and you don't type anything oh you need to type something sorry so let's say uh, you type just zero and result will be total inhalation of telephone numbers and this is not that scary but imagine if you are deleting a unique uh, um, like personal identification or something like um, people's salaries uh, hourly rates and so on i mean this me this is like a total disaster so just remember use update uh where and set specific column to be I don't know one two three four five six some actual data okay but uh, column X specific column uh, yeah right now then press enter and then say where don't forget where open normal brackets and say column X for example that it is a ID and uh, column Y for example is like uh, names or something like that but be very very precise okay and after that just type semicolon and issue a comment now i advise you if you're creating something for your client uh do create backups of your database before issuing updates manually and even when you're writing scripts because because man you can totally i don't want to even think about that i mean it can be disaster so anyway i'm just gonna shut up um you see basically what I'm talking about here. It can be dangerous. Don't play around too much. Put things on the paper. Do have a backup and you will probably be fine. As always, thank you for watching. Thank you for support and subscription and see you next tutorial.